This is Katie Boykin with your News in 90. The University of Florida is constructing new buildings for two student unions. The previous buildings for La Casita and the Institute for Black Culture violated current building code. You have decided to demolish these existing buildings after multiple attempts at renovation. The initial plan of conjoined buildings with a common kitchen and elevator was replaced by two separate structures. The new buildings will be on the same site as the old ones and are expected to open in fall 2019. Firefighters have been disciplined by the Hillsborough County Fire Department after refusing to take a woman to the hospital. Three firefighters were suspended and one fired after denying aid to new mother Crystal Galloway. Lieutenant John Mike Morris, Acting Lieutenant Courtney Barton, and Fire Medics Justin Sweeney and Andrew Martin were concerned that Galloway would not be able to afford an ambulance. County Administrator Mike Merrill says their two-month-long investigation found no basis of race or refusing to transport. Galloway later died from complications of a stroke. The Senate Judiciary Committee opens their hearing on Supreme Court nominee Judge Brett Kavanaugh. Dr. Christine Blasey Ford claims that Brett Kavanaugh sexually assaulted her back in the 1980s when she was 15 years old. She says the Supreme Court nominee groped and mountained her, but she was too inco intoxicated to follow through on his motives. In today's Senate hearing, she said she was terrified to testify, but felt it was her civic duty to tell the truth. Kavanaugh denies all allegations. That's your news in 90, but your Florida news is always on at WUFT.org.